Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel, the Taylor Toned YouTube channel. I'm Gabby and today I'm bringing you a full body Pilates and bar inspired workout. This one is 24 minutes long and you don't need any equipment but I would advise a mat, a soft surface, something to protect you from the floor. If you've not hit subscribe, do that right now. Press the bell so you get notified whenever I upload something brand new. Also give me a follow on my Instagram, I am at Taylor Toned. Do I turn the aircon on? I'm super hot. I think I'm gonna survive without the aircon, otherwise I'll be sneezing the whole video and nobody wants that. Okay, let's get straight into the burn and the shape. Let's do this, starting in kneeling position. Bring your left hand forward. You're gonna flex your fingertips to the floor. Bring your right fingertips onto your left fingertips. Press the heel of the hand forward, lengthen through those forearms, and then switch it up. Grab a hold of the other fingertips. Press the heel of the hand forwards. You're gonna roll through the wrists. You're gonna roll through the shoulders. Bring the weight forwards. Hands stack under the shoulders, knees under the hips. Now tuck the toes, lift the knees. We tap left knee or right knee a left knee and then right knee go left knee so this is your option here for your advancement if you want the modified version i'm going to show you now so we just lift we tap one knee then center then tap down so pick your option if you're with me in that advancement keep going ahead tapping those knees keep the abs pulled in we go tap and tap you've got 10 and nine more you have eight more you've got seven you've got six we hold in five in four in three, we hold in two, in one. Now you're gonna lift and hover those knees off. Squeeze the belly button in. Step your left foot back. Go ahead, step your right foot back. Drop one forearm down. You're gonna drop the other forearm down. Bring the eye line in between your wrists. Keep squeezing the belly button up. Belly button towards your spine. Take a little bend through both knees. So we bend, extend their knees, bend. You're in a forearm plank position. Feel this in the lumbar spine. Drop those knees, reset yourself. I want you to think, one straight line through the body, tuck the tail, we go, little bend, extend, modified version, you want to tap, tuck, lift, advancement, keep going here, we go, little bend, extend, drawing those abdominals up and in, you have five, keep going, four, and lift, I know, go three, then push, you've got two, and press, last one, keep those knees nice and straight, roll the shoulders down the back, squeeze the abdominals in you have just 10 seconds here nine go eight drop the knees in seven in six drop the knees in five in four full plank go three go two one drop those knees down sweep the feet forward instantly two minutes in I'm already regressing the aircon situation bring your fingertips to your heels you're gonna lift those hips off we go big bend big push. Let's warm up those arms. So now you've warmed up the core, you've warmed up the upper body. Bend the elbows backwards. We go bend, then push. The hips are equally between your hands and your feet. Keep going, bend. Go push. Three, bend, press. Two, bend and press. Now last one, just hold down there. Can you rock the weight backwards for the advancement? Want it easier? Rock the weight forwards. Now tiny presses down. You have 10 pulses. Nine, eight, seven, six. You've got five more pulses. Four, go three, go two, and one. Sweep your feet behind yourself. Straight into an arm set. I'm gonna take this one on my hips today. You're gonna bring your palms forwards. Lift and lift. We go down and down. We squeeze their elbows in, then reach. So this is your option here. I've got a lot of clients that do have knee injuries or issues. If you want, you can take this kneeling up here, but my head will be out of the shot, so I'm gonna go on my butt. We go down, go down. We go bend, then reach. So we go over for two. We go drop for two. Go bend and reach. Keep going, go over and over. We go down and down. We go squeeze and reach. We go up and up. reach those fingers tips towards the sky elbows in reach two more lift go lift we take it down and down we go elbows in then reach one more we lift we lift we take it down and down we go elbows in we reach and hold little tiny then reaches extend 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 now draw the belly button in towards your spine keep rolling those shoulders backwards and down and let's burn out those arms palm towards me little tiny bend and press 
press, press. You've got eight here, seven here, six here. You've got five more. We're gonna hold stillness. In three, in two. Now last one, stay there, lengthen those arms away from yourself. Embrace your inner ballerina by sliding your shoulders down your back. Tiny little lift hold, drop hold. One lift, one drop with the fingertips. Little lift, little drop. Extend through those fingertips. Get those arms nice and long. You've got four more. You've got three more here, keep going. You've got two, little drop. Now last one, you're gonna bring both elbows in, reach. Woo. Feels good to bring those elbows in. Feels tough to reach away. Go big bend, extend, big bend. Let's take a little cardio burst here. So we're gonna go in, out, in, out, in, out. Maybe spread those fingertips like you're doing some jazz hands. We come in, out. The jazz hands can't stop now, apparently. We come in, out, in, out. So you have just 10, just nine, just eight. You've got seven, keep the arms out there. In five, control the action. You've got three, I know you're burning. Two, one, extend, flip the palms and a lift. Little lift, little lift, little lift. Keep going, you've got 20 seconds of lifting and then we're gonna take tiny pushes back. Little pinky to the sky. Is your little pinky in line with your shoulders. We go lift and lift. You've got eight seconds, then we're gonna take tiny presses back. Oh my gosh, five, go four. We push in three, in two, in one. We go, little press, little press, little press. You stay there, so I'm going little tiny pushes back. Fingertips in line with the shoulders. Little press, little press, little press. Option, faster, but control it. It's a tiny press back. You have just seven, just six, Whew, five. You've got four, you've got three. You're out in two, one. Oh, well done, you're gonna straight away, lower down onto the left side of your body, just like this. So left side of the body, drop the head down towards that arm. The back leg is gonna take a high heel position. So you've got a high heel position just like this. Underneath leg, extends, now flex. One lift, one drop, one lift, one drop. If you've got quite bony hips here, you might wanna grab a hold of a towel, pop it underneath your hips. But I don't want you to be square to me like this. You wanna rock back onto the cushion part of the seat. So the outside of the butt, that cushion part, you want your hip forwards and you're on the cushion. So this is inner thigh work. So we're toning, sculpting those inner thighs. We go lift up and lower down. We go one lift, one drop. You've got five more here. Keep going. You've got four and drop. You've got three. Keep pushing those front fingertips in. Two. Now last one. We lift and hold. Stay there. Try and keep the leg off the floor. If you want it even more intense, your big toe turns down to the floor. Your heel is higher than your big toe. We go bend press, bend press, bend press. Your skull and tone in those inner thighs right now as long as your leg is off the floor. Little press, little press, little press, little press. So remember it's your inner thigh that is working. So you want a slight rock backwards. You'll see if I let my fingertips go, I'll fall over. So you want to make sure you're on the outside of the butt, then pressing that heel away. You have just eight, just seven, go six, see you've got five. You're gonna add a little lift in four. We're lifted in three, in two, last one. Now lift up, lift and lift. So you should really feel that in the inner thigh. Press your fingertips down. It's like a deep burn through your inner thigh. Little press, little press, little press. Oh my golly gosh. You've got eight, seven, holding six, Woo. five. You've got four, pull six, go three, go two, hold there. Can you dial your toe down? Can you kick that heel one inch higher? Go seven, go six, you've got five, go four, lift that inside leg higher, go three, go two, and one. Stay down there, stack the legs. We go one lift, one lower, one lift, one drop now a little bit faster. Go down, press. Now don't let your knees touch. Go down, lift, down, lift. Eight, seven, six, you've got five, you've got four more, you've got three more, you've got two. Now last one, we hold there. Can you go ahead? Can you squeeze that toe round towards me? And can you go ahead, squeeze it all the way back. Inhale, exhale, squeeze that toe to me. Inhale, exhale, bring it back. Now option, either stay down here for the modified version, want it a little bit harder. You're gonna press your hand on towards your head and it'll give you a deeper burnout into the butt. You've got three more here. We go, bring it in, two more. Extend press. We sweep it in, one more. Now you're gonna extend, press and hold, flex the foot again and turn that toe down. Another toe, 
taps the floor, lift, Woo. tap and lift. Any hip issues or injuries here, you can bring the foot on this diagonal. If you want it super, super hard, stick with me. Bring that heel right round towards me. We lift, we go for a tap down, lift up. We go one tap, one lift. It should be a bird on the side of the butt. You've got three, lift. You've got two, lift. Last one, now lift and hold. Turn the toe down, tiny presses up with that heel. Squeeze, squeeze, we go squeeze and squeeze, go squeeze. Can you send this top hand up towards the sky? Lifting that heel up, tiny presses. You've just got 10, nine, eight, then more booty burning. You got seven, six more seat work, five, go four, go three, go two, one. Lift up, you're gonna flip it round onto your forearms. Same leg that was in the air needs to squeeze heel to pull up but I need to press that leg up towards the sky. The leg that's in the air, that forearm stays down. This hand steps to the side. Little press, little press. That last exercise was all about the side of the butt. This is now about the top of that butt. Keep pulsing that toe up and up. We go for a squeeze and squeeze. Now draw the belly button away from the floor. Roll the shoulders down, away from your ears. We're just pulsing that toe. Left forearm on the floor, right hand to the side. You don't want to have this hand out towards the side or you'll open through the hip. You'll be tempted to open through the hip. So wanna keep those hips closed. Hip bones are pointing at the floor and you're driving here through this butt cheek as much as you can. Little squeeze, little squeeze. You've got eight more, seven, six. You've got five. We change in four, in three. We change in two. Now hold, flex their heel. We go one squeeze, one push. One squeeze, one push. One squeeze, one push. Keep going, I know. And press. You've got five and push. You've got four that are pulsing. Press. You've got three more pulsing. Push. You've got two. Press. Now last one. Press. Just lift. Just lift. Just lift. Go eight. Go seven. Go six. Stick with me. Five. Go four. You've got three. Two, now hold, stay there, draw the abdominals in. You're gonna scoot this leg backwards, you're gonna tuck the toe under, tuck the toe, keep this hand placement, lift both the knees off and come in towards that forearm plank with a hand to the side, draw the abs in. Want the modified version? Drop the forearms down. Once the adva want the advanced version? Keep that hand to the side, hips are square down towards the ground. Either thigh squeeze together, a little bit of arm work here and ab work. You've got stillness of four, a final, just go. Inhale and exhale. You now have 10 seconds, nine, go eight. You've got seven, I know. Go six, go five, go four. You're out in three, in two, one. Whew. Lift yourself up. Give yourself a little roll around. What six minutes that was. You're gonna flip it around and now we've gotta go to the side. So lay yourself down on towards the arm. Turn that back leg into a high heel, roll onto the sit bone and flex the foot. We go one tap, one lift, one tap, one lift. We go one tap, one lift. So you've almost rolled backwards a little tiny bit. You're onto the side of the butt and you really wanna connect your mind to body and think about the burn being here in that inner thigh. Ground these fingertips down and towards the floor, lengthen through that working leg. Lengthen through the knee, lift that heel. You want it harder, remember the toe delves down, the heel lifts higher. We go for a lift up and lower down. Keep going, one lift, one drop. If you want the advanced version, don't let the foot tap the floor. If you want the modified version, let that foot drop down. You've got four more, three more, drop. We go, two, drop. Now last one, lift and hold. Little tiny bend and press. Go press, go press. Little tiny, tiny bend. Tiny bend through that knee. Can you invert that toe deeper down towards the floor? So turn your big toe all the way down towards the floor. Little press, little press, little press. Pressing that heel away. You should feel it in towards that inner thigh. Remember you've rolled slightly back on towards the side of the butt. And the higher that heel gets, the more you're gonna burn your inner thigh, the more you're gonna scorp that inner thigh. You've got 10, nine, Eight, you've got seven of a pulse in six. Go five, you've got four of them a pulse in three. Go two, one. Little lift, little lift, 
little lift. Now that should really get in towards your inner thigh. If it doesn't, make sure you're on the side of the butt and the toe is down. The heel is high, little squeeze, little squeeze. Keep going up with the heel. You've got 10 more presses, nine. We hold in a whoo, seven, six. We hold in five, in four. We hold in three, oh my gosh, two. Now hold, turn the toe down, lift that heel higher. You have five, four, then stack the legs. Three, two, one. Stack the legs, we go, little lift, little drop. Don't wallow in the bird. Keep going, continue with me, you can do it. If I can do it, you definitely can. We go, lift and drop. Go lift and drop. If you want it harder, we're gonna go down, up, down, up, down, up. Now don't let the knees touch. Maybe grab a hold, maybe pop your hand even. Don't grab your hand. Pop your hand on top of that thigh. Take little tiny presses. We go down, lift. Is your knee and your toe staying in a straight alignment? Could you balance something here on the calf? You've got eight. Go seven. Go six. We're gonna take that toe extension to me in four, in three, in two, in one. We go extend press, inhale, squeezing it in. Extend press, let's flex that foot so you get a deeper burn. Extend flex, we go inhale, squeeze it in. Remember tight hamstrings, any hip issues, you can take it out on the diagonal to the side of yourself. For that full advancement, flex that heel right to me, squeeze it back in. We go flex and press, we go squeeze it back in. Three more, flex and push and then squeeze in two more. We go flex and push. We squeeze it in one more. We flex and push. We squeeze it in. Now shoot that toe all the way round towards me. Modification, bring it on a diagonal. Advancement, tip that toe down. Little tap, little lift, little tap, little lift. We go, little tap, little lift. Now don't let the toe touch the floor. Option, can you bring this hand to the head to make it even more challenging? We tap, we lift, we tap. Up, lift, keep going, toe goes down, the heel leads. Five, you've got four more, and then we're going to flip on towards our front. You've got three, and lift, you've got two, lift, last one, lift, sweep round. You're gonna send that forearm down to the floor, or the forearm down, heel to the butt, squeeze the toe. Leg in the air, same forearm down, left forearm down, right hand to the side, tiny pokes up. Little squeeze, little squeeze, little squeeze. So that left leg's in the air, if you don't no left from your right, just mirror me. So whatever leg I've got in the air right now, mirror me on the screen at home. We go, little squeeze, little squeeze. So leg in the air, that forearm is down to the ground and other hand towards the side to support yourself. We go, little squeeze, little squeeze. <sighs> lift, go lift. Eye line just next towards your wrist. Now pull the abdominals in. Work on getting that gorgeous flat line through the upper body, crown of the head, down towards those sit bones. You've got a ruler up the back of your t-shirt and your leg is a little squeeze. Squeeze, little squeeze, keep going, go push. Now really poke with that toe. Imagine you've got a three kilogram weight and you're pushing it to the sky. Little poke, you've got that flex and push in five, in four. We squeeze in three, in two, in one. We flex, we go little hug, little push, little hug, little push, little hug, little push. Don't let those shoulders creep up. Remember, change your waistline and your upper body by keeping those shoulders down. We squeeze, we push, we squeeze, we push, we squeeze, we push. Now pulse it out. Little press, little press, little press. Tuck the tail under. Don't sit in towards that supporting hip. Hips are square. We go, little push. You've got five. Go four. We're planking in three, in two, in one. Stay there. Modification. Drop both the forearms down. Advancement. Tuck one toe. You can do it. Use that upper body strength. Tuck the other toe and come in towards your plank position. Forearm down. Other hand to the side. Draw those abdominals in. Stick with me. Breathe in. How you made it through that next six minutes you've got your abs left to go and that is it so squeeze the belly button in and make the change that you want to your body today you're out in ten in nine in eight you're out in seven in six you've got to go five go four drop the knees in three two one Whew. Roll straight, regretting the AC choice now. You're gonna roll straight away on towards your back. Bring the hands around the side of the chest. Lift one leg up, pull the abs down, tuck under, pull the abs in. Close the ribs together, lift the other leg and stay there. Can you make sure you've got your knees over the top of the hips 
and you want to make sure your toes are in line with those knees. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. You're going to extend your left leg up. We're going to go press, press, lift, replace. We go press, press, lift, replace. We go press, press, go lift, replace. We go press, press, Scoop, replace. So you want to want it. You really want to draw that heel down to the floor. It's really hard to count and think of the cues. We go extend, push, press, press something heavy down to the floor. Extend, drive the heel in, lower back down towards the ground. Two, go press, press up, replace. One more, extend, push, push, lift. Replace, squeeze those inner thighs together. Inhale in, exhale away. We're gonna go single toe taps. We go right toe, lift, left toe, lift. Get your hand now. Can it slide under your lumbar spine? If it can, you're doing it wrong. So you shouldn't have a big bridge like that. You should be really trying to guide your spine nice and long. Switch on the abs, switch off the lower back. So we squeeze the belly button down. Think about how you want your stomach to look. You want it nice and flat, so right now, work as much as you can and draw on your abdominals flat. You have four, you have three here. Keep going, two, lift, one. Now lift and hold, knees over the top of the hips. Bring both the hands to the sky, tiny, bend reaches, bend press. We go, little reach, little reach, little reaches towards the sky. You have just five, just four. Next option in three, in two. Now last one, stay here. Modification, stay right here. If you feel like you can give me a little bit more. Inhale as you exhale. We go lengthen, lengthen, and then squeeze it in. So we send the body nice and long. Further option here, modification, just do the arms and then reach it forward. So you want the challenge, do the arms and the legs. If it hurts your lumbar spine, reset. See if you can keep the lumbar spine down as you do it. If you can't, just move those arms. You'll still get a good burnout. We go, extend, press, inhale, in three. Extend, push, inhale, in two. Extend, push, you can do it. Inhale, in, last one now, extend. You're gonna do it, lengthen and hold. Modification here, advancement, hands are backwards. Stay there, those legs are in front of yourself, those lower abs are down. You have just three, two, one. Oh, I am so sweaty right now. Knees in towards the chest, hug them in nice and tight. Rock yourself gently side to side, left to right, left to right. Inhale and exhale. Rock yourself backwards. You're gonna rock yourself straight away, all the way up forwards. Bring both of those feet lovely and long in front. Your left leg hooks over the top of that right leg. Either stay here, pulling the chest up, if that's okay for you. If you want a little bit of a deeper stretch, you're gonna wrap round to that bent leg. For the full advancement, this elbow slides past the knee, twist round and stay there. Back through the center, lengthen the feet long. Inhale, grow tall. Exhale, reaching down. Sweep those hands down the side of the legs. Left foot now hooks over the top of that right leg. Give a little hug on the leg, stay there. Ground the sit bones in towards the floor. Breathe in, breathe out, exhale away. You're gonna send that other leg over the top, right foot over the top of the left knee. Hugging that knee nice and tight, grow nice and tall. If that's okay for you, bring your left elbow, slice it past your right knee and twist round towards the side. Open the heart to me. Maybe take the gaze backwards over that shoulder. Breathe in, exhale. Twist from the torso, not the hips. Bring the feet forwards really carefully. Swing both those feet round towards the back. Hands under the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. Favorite ever move, cat and cow. Inhale, take a little scoop. Release that, release those abdominals. Exhale, press the chest down. Lift the eyeline up. Back through a neutral spine position. Draw the belly button up. You're gonna tuck both those toes under. And now draw the heels down. You're gonna lift the hips and take a down dog. Press those hips up, inhale, lift the heels. Exhale, push the heels low. Again, another time, inhale, lift the heels up. 
exhale drop the heels low there's actually sweat on my mat like lots of it <laughs> you're gonna now bend through the knees drop those knees down towards the floor allow your hips to come towards your feet and give yourself a little shoulder roll if you were sweaty during this workout leave me a comment down below give yourself a little shoulder roll around turn it all the way around towards me we're going to take some lateral flexion bring your right hand down to the floor take a side lean over inhale any spinal injuries just go straight to the second side now if you've not got any spinal injuries you're going to inhale Exhale, draw a little half circle. Roll, be really mindful of the neck. Left arm down, right hand reaches. All the way back through the center, sweeping the left arm across the chest, right hand loops under, head goes to the side. And then bring the other arm across the chest, arm loops under, head goes to the side. Drop the hands down, give yourself a little shoulder roll round, shoulder roll round. Now guide the palms together, create some connection between the palms, roll the shoulders down. Inhale through the nose. Big exhale through the mouth, let any tension you're holding on to go. Give yourself a little shake off side to side. Give yourself a little clap wherever you are and well done in your workout with me today. Well done in your tailor toned workout. Hope you loved that one. Make sure you give me a massive thumbs up on this video. Leave your comments and feedback down below. I'd love to know how you found it. I'm very good. Even my wrists are sweaty. <laughs> I'd love to know how you found it at home. I'll see you next time. As long as you hit subscribe, press the bell to so get notified whenever I upload. Bye everyone.